Alrighty. So we got it pulled out here. And this is what it looks like, all packaged up. It pulls out all as one, so you don't have to worry about it falling apart. As you pull up, everything's bound together. The fork. Handlebars, front tire. It's all nicely zip tied together. Holds together as you pull it out. Of course, the only thing I did notice was the battery was out. So we'll finish pulling that out. So battery is about two feet long. Alrighty, we'll get that out and charging. And we'll maybe start taking this apart and seeing what's going on. Oh wait, before we get that far, at the bottom of the box, we did have this. Let's see what we have. Got our charger. Looks like probably a cap for something. Reflector. And of course, our wonderful instructions that, you know, looks not read. Now nah, we'll read it and see. But, looks like it comes with. Wrenches. What is it? 15, 16, 17 millimeter Phillips small wrench and an Allen with another Phillips. So Let's see what the instructions tell us. Alrighty. Parts and components. Getting started. Installing the front wheel. Gears, derailleur, display, how to operate it, what everything means, I'm sure. And just so you know, guys, you can get this on eBay for under 500 shipped to your door. Now you cannot find a fat tire e-bike with this wattage and amp hour battery on Amazon or anywhere else shipped to your house for that price. Um, you can find fat tire bikes and stuff they won't look this cool and you can get them for like 300 bucks but then they want another 300 dollars for shipping and everything else so you're paying a ton for shipping so if you find this dyu v8 model on ebay um it's sold right through dyu themselves um killer deal on these if you want to get into it uh, fairly cheap in my opinion 
and have something that's gonna run you a long time uh, with a good battery life and plenty of power. Or at least I'm assuming. It's my first one and with the research I've done, you know, I think this should be plenty for what we're gonna use it for. Compared to a lot of Chinese bikes I've seen, this chain looks pretty good quality. It does not look like those tin chains that I've seen on some of the other bikes. So I like that. Protecting probably a sensor, yeah. Okay. Probably something in relation to speed. The seat is firm, but I bet you it will be good and comfortable. skills are kind of sucking trying to do this one-handed yeah. I mean I'm really impressed with the packaging they did a really good job I don't see any scratches the box was delivered very well um, no damages you know they really thought it through as far as where to package everything so nothing gets damaged. Of course, there's a DYU tag on it. Looking good so far. Tires are mostly inflated. Oh.
position. Okay. And here's the keys. Back to the wheel shock. Uh, nice little kickstand. Like that. This, even for the price, has hydraulic brakes, which I thought was pretty cool. Alrighty. Now, we'll just flip the handlebars up and mount it to our center stud here and get that so it's out of our way. So, we'll hold on for a second while I do that. <laughs> 